Welcome back. So in this video, we are going to take a look into SMrush position rank tracking tool. We have seen so many tools to find keywords with traditional methods using competitors as a keyword research sources. Now SMrush provides certain tools to uh, track our keyword ranking progress because we want to keep a track on all the keywords which we are targeting on to see the progress we are making whether we are improving whether we are declining or whether we are ranking for the right target keyword so how we are performing all these data need to be tracked and that is what we can do from position tracking with this is also be uh, can be accessible from several sources the common one is from keyword research under position tracking you can access it i have hidden some of my personal domains here but just i am going to click on setup on one of this domain this is one of my personal projects and here you can see with, uh, below than that basically it is going to select me a domain uh, to track uh, for keywords then it is going to ask me for the search engine. I'm going to select a search engine which is interested to me because SMrush offering three different uh, domain uh, search engine to track your position. It either can rank track uh, keyword position on Google or Bing or even Beidou. So depending on your need, you can select one. Google will be the most common one. Then you select the device you want to track because you know that search engine ranking position will be differing or the ranking of results of pages will be different for different devices. We already know this. So for desktop, mobile or tablet, most of the will be users will be using either mobile or desktop. So you can choose whichever the one you want. Then you can select a location. You can either select a country here or just enter a city name also if possible for example i want to select chennai maybe then i can select chennai and it automatically will show me all the different options available for me and you can also see the business name i want to see a national volume or local volume i want to see the national volume and business name for local path this is where if you are tracking a position tracking for a local businesses you can also enter the local uh, business website URL, but you can also enter their local business name. That way it will keep a track of that URL and also it will track uh, keep a track of that Google map ranking also. For example, I'm going to enter something and it will suggest me. For example, I'm just going to enter my local company uh, website on digital marketing and I can just enter something like that and it will automatically try to track that business name also. Then I can continue to keyword and here when I click on continue to keyword, I can add keyword here and I can add a tag also here and not only I can on add keyword but I can add it in a different way where well, I can add only keywords and I add a common tag or I can add different keywords and tag it different ways or I can import from different sources. I can import from a text or CSV file or I can send uh, import from another campaign or I can import from SMRS suggestion itself a uh, various keyword or I can bring keywords from Google Analytic or so. So depending on my need, I can select it or I can just make it simple and do something like Tamil quotes or something like that. And I can add a keyword to campaign and I'm added a keyword to campaign and you can see tracking is not yet started. It shows the keyword limit on, out of my total number of limit, how much keyword I'm using for position tracking. This number will range depending on the SMrush plan you are on. So depending on that, you can either select this if you want to send uh, receive ranking alerts via email. If not, just click on start tracking or as soon as you pressed on that uh, option it automatically will start uh, getting all the position tracking results for you now i'm going to pause and open up another campaign of my web uh, tracking which i using with smrush to show all the data available for you okay you can see i have opened up an another project of mine which is called matchmaker.lk it is a matrimony uh, project which we run for Sri Lankan uh, users and basically this is how it will look like after a couple of days of position rank tracking it will show a visibility score uh, for our target keywords 
estimated traffic we are receiving and average position we are seeing the estimated traffic is bit low uh, if it's not a us database i noticed with sm rush especially for a foreign countries sometimes it predicts the estimated traffic very low compared to the other bigger database uses so the estimated traffic is not accurate most of the time but visibility and average position is accurate most of the time then we see several tabs here like for example all the different one i will go one by one because landscape will give you a summary uh, data then it will give you link which will go into different sections of this page to give a more understanding for us uh, basically this is a summary of uh, what smrush thinks of our ranking position for different keywords it will give you overall summary like explaining like a seo consultant it will explain it to you for example what it's saying is traffic performance for this particular site for this country you are targeting this uh, target a uh, device as declined from january 17 to Jan january 19 by this percentage visibility has changed for these keywords so these are the keyword which has primarily declined you have potential com competitor this particular person which has a visibility grown by 1.21 percentage estimated traffic for this page has decreased by this amount and estimated traffic for this particular page has grown by 2.55 so we are getting a basic summary view here it's a beta stage project you can also copy this as well ranking distribution is where it will show out of all the keywords which i am tracking how many keywords which i am ranked on seven uh, each day at what position for example it says on top three i am currently ranking two keywords top 10 i am ranking 6 keyword top 20 i am ranking 7 keywords top 100 9 keywords and also you see this kind of a trend data so what does that mean is like uh, for the previous day i actually add one more uh, keyword also on top 20 which i have lost right now and here also i can say the same data in a different structure here so it show me how many keyword has improved how many has declined all these links are clickable links which will take you to one of this subsection with the more details for you and if i scroll down here now it will show me top keywords of mine like which are the keywords which is really top uh, for my particular website and you can see those keyword and i can see all my keywords by clicking on this link it will take me to one of these pages to give you a big overview and positive impact means these are the keyword which has improved in ranking in this section for example you can see uh, for sri lankan matrimony uh, we received one more position like it went came from 9 to 8 so it is a improved positive gain negative impact keyword similar in uh, similar in nature but whichever the keyword which negatively got affected for example matrimony sri lanka got reduced from 8 to 9 so that is going to be coming under negative impact keyword we can see all this keyword in detail by just clicking on this button then we have the tag also like we as when i were adding position tracking we can add tags right as i shown when i created a project you can add also more tags to manage keywords by tag also basically you can group uh, different keywords with different tags you can obviously add more keywords also here not only you can add the keyword from the initial get go but here you can see it shows the nine different keyword but i can come here and add more keywords also here to track uh, for me then we have market uh, traffic versus selected domain trends where we uh, found all your competitors on sub add your competitor is like like i want to add competitors so clicking on add competitors what it will do is it will automatically uh, show me some of the popular competitors for me depending on the keyword which they are ranking so i can select a uh, various competitors for me you can see these are suggested by organic these are suggested from google adwords so maybe i will add one more from here and as soon as click on update now it will compare whatever my website to my competitor website also so you can see all the different one so average position ranking all these things and we will get the data in one of that tab also then we have serp features 
out of uh, all the different one whichever the one which uh, matchmaker ranks our site ranks for example we are on one featured snippet and uh, whichever the snippet we don't have it and we are seeing from local pack all the different SERP features it will show me all the different data which we are ga gathering on that particular ranking then we have pages pages is where all the different top uh, web pages within our website which is ranking for various keywords which we are tracking so for the example out of keywords i have added eight keyword is ranking for our home page and how is the average position looking like and whether it is improved or not all the details are shown here we can see it separately also with improved and declined also it is only showing couple of things because i have not added all the keywords just for sample campaign i have added some keywords but when you are adding more keywords and pages it will show a lot more data visibility is location is something like from a location perspective and data from different platform uh, like desktop mobile tablet it will show the data unfortunately i'm on a pro plan so it doesn't show me the data if you have a group plan or a business plan then you can able to see these data as well for you then we have cannibalization of health section this will also go into one of the tab where basically this is where when uh, one uh, two or more pages in your website is trying to rank for one single keyword that way itself you itself becoming a competitor to your web uh, website so ideally what you want to do is you want to find these instances and make only one web page to target for that keyword that way you can either try to avoid comfort confusion within your website that way clearing um, giving a clear message to search engine also to make sure that you are targeting this keyword only on this web page so if it find any opportunities like that it will show that data within cannibalization of l section here then we if we go into overview section as overview section we will get an overview of all the different um, visibility estimated traffic average position we are ranking all this data is shown here share of voice is not available on my plan so i can't comment on that we also have various filters here to select da data for others also for example i can click on visibility i can add one more domain or couple of domains and I can see both of data within the chart itself. So I can compare all the different domains here as well. And I can add up to four, uh, five different domains here. Then I can filter the do data also. For example, it does not make sense because I only have nine keywords. So I can see all the data here. But let's say, for example, I have hundreds of keywords. Then these uh, filtering options also will make sense for me. And if I scroll down, I will get a ranking overview section where it will show me all the ranking overview. It will give me some control and actions to add keyword, remove keyword. And also it will show me the exact keyword and the intent of the keyword with the option to see the actual SERP snippet. So if I click on this, it is showing me that I am ranking on a feature snippet on this particular web page. So it will show me that data here and it will show me the keyword difficulty and how my uh, ranking is uh, in a history sort of way like on 17th also I was ranking on first and 19th also I was ranking on the first and so I get a get an idea on the differences and everything total volume for this particular keyword and uh, what is the CPC score for this particular keyword. So those data are shown here similarly for other keywords also shown here with the number of pages section then we have ranking distribution ranking distribution is where it will show based on all the key our domain and for competitor which we have added how their ranking is uh, overviewed for example out of all the sites added this particular competitor has the most amount of visibility in this space they have around 47 0.3 visibility where we only have around 19.87 visibility so we can see the visibility how much their estimated traffic and how many keywords they on the keyword which we are tracking 
they are on top three top 10 top 20 top 100 all the keyword data is also shown here and ranking in top three it shows these keywords are ranking on top three for these people and top 10 ranking results are shown here top 20 ranking results by different people uh, competitors is shown here top 100 results are shown here so it's giving me in a ranking distribution overview here tags is where i am not able to access the tag report specifically because it is available from guru and business plan where you can tag different keywords and compare the tags and see those data here as well pages is where it will show the position tracking by the ranking pages for example rather than seeing the keyword then associated with url in this report it will show you the url and associated with keyword for example this is the url which is ranking uh, for like eight different uh, position and what is the estimated traffic and how they are differing so all url new url lost all the data by pages will be shown here cannibalization as i explained it will show you unfortunately not available for me it is only available for guru and business users competitor discovery is where it will automatically try to compare the competitors which i have identified but it will also identify other competitors from organic uh, research it will find the competitors it will also give me a winners and losers section here who are winning who are losing you can see the minus and everything and if i scroll down you can see smrush itself has identified around 290 competitors for me so i can get an idea i can go through this i can add this if i really like this competitor i want to keep a track of his ranking i can add a competitor i can select i domain if if SMRush has identified some unnecessary or unrelated competitor to, for me, I can hide the domain and you can see the differences, estimated traffic, how they are performing on different keywords, all the data here. You can see you can also scroll through it and you have the filters to filter this competitors as well. Then we have devices and location not available for my plan. Basically, you can compare the rank, position rank tracking based on different uh, location, languages and multiple devices here. Then we have featured snippets where now it shows the position rank tracking or Google SERP rank tracking, especially for featured snippets on SERP, like whichever the snippets we got a uh, featured snippet ranking. So that all the data is like that, it will show for me opportunities. Like I am already featured on this particular keyword, but there is an opportunity for this particular keyword where another competitor is ranking for that. So it's saying me, okay, you can try to go for this keyword also, try to grab that. So it is also tracking the feature snippet also separately. So that is all the features of position tracking. Basically, this will help you to get a high level overview and also an in-depth overview of all your ranking in your SERP, not only yours, but your competitors also will be visible to you.